students, students, I have some terrible news I need to tell you right away. It cannot wait another second. Wait, wait, is, um, is this, is this recording? Uh, hello, uh, am I muted? No, 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 okay. Um, well, am I talking loud enough? Uh, maybe if I just get a little bit closer. Okay, there, yeah, that's better. As I was saying, I have some devastating informu- information. Our production has been canceled. You all work so hard, and I was so looking forward to our dress rehearsal tonight. But I am sorry to report that our production of Brushes with Greatness, the dental hygiene musical, will never see the light of day. The world will never witness your interpretation of this great American classic. I know they say the the show must go on, but in this case, well, it can't. Um, okay, uh, I, I, I should go. Uh, goodbye for now. Uh, now, how do I hang this thing up? Uh, Siri, Siri, end, end video. Okay, great. Well, that was easy. Um, hello? Oh, oh, yes. Hello, um, Principal Snellgrove. Um, yes, I know the, the, the show has been canceled, but... But oh, wait, 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 no, 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 no. The, the drama department can't shut down permanently. Y- yes, I, I understand that the musical was supposed to raise money for next year, but no, 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 no don't go. Um, we can't get rid of the entire drama program and... Goodbye. Oh, this, di- this didn't send. Okay, well, maybe if I press the button that says send, it will find... <laughs> All cast and crew, did you see that video? Wow, Tribe does not know how to use technology. But more importantly, we can't lose the drama department. We have to do something. No matter what obstacles we face, life mirrors art. And this is just like our musical. Like Bob Flossie says at the start of Rest with Greatness. We don't give up. Well, maybe it's not like the last part, but you know what I mean. Let me know what you think. Hello, fellow thespians. I'm speaking to you all from inside my closet, where I retreated as soon as I heard the terrible news. I decided to move in here and hide away from the rest of the world. After all, if there's no musical theater, what is the point of going outside? I will live out the rest of my days nestled amongst my old costumes, my tap shoes, and my signed poster from last year's production of Susicle the Musical. I was a great year to the turtle, wasn't I? Don't cry for me, former castmates. I'll be fine. I'll be here tweening at Lin-Manuel Miranda and quietly humming the score to Pippin for the rest of eternity. Good luck with the rest of your lives. So long, farewell, of Weeder saying goodbye. And scene. Ugh, we can't just crawl into our closets. We have to bring brushes with greatness to life and save the drama program. I have an idea. You know how we're all sending videos to each other right now? What if we did a show online just like this? I mean, if you can order Ben Platt's used tissue, you can totally do a show on... Um, not that anyone would order a used tissue off the internet. What kind of a person would spend $40 on something like that? Totally ridiculous. Nobody would. I know I wouldn't. Yuck. All I'm saying is you can do a lot on the internet. We can film ourselves, piece scenes together to make a full musical. We could... Oh, dear, but Hanson, what have I done? Yes, that is a genius idea. 
Not the $40 tissue, that's ridiculous, but a virtual musical is a great idea. We'll perform Brushes with Greatness, the dental hygiene musical, at home and stream it online. Check it out. I can do the opening number from my living room. Right? The only problem is Tribe. I don't think he's going to like this idea very much. He's pretty scared of technology. How do we get him to agree? Um, I may have an idea on how we could get Tribe to agree. I wrote a little something. I'm not sure if it's any good, but maybe it could help. I don't usually perform my songs, but we have to save the drama club. So, here goes nothing. School is closed, theater too. What are the actors supposed to do? How do we go on with the show? We've rehearsed, we've sung along. We know the words to every song. We're prepared, but where do we go? We go online, set the lights, fail the screen. The show must go on. The show must go online, piece by piece, scene by scene. The show must go on, the show must go online. So dust off that webcam, yeah, make it shine. The show must go on, online. So, what do you think? That was beautiful. I must say, I am moved, deeply moved. I'll admit, at first I was hesitant, but, but after hearing that song, uh, I say we go for it. The show must go online. Please reach out to me if you have any questions about your performance uh, or the technology. I have a Hotmail account and a MySpace account. I am very connected. Oh, you have inspired me and given me great hope. Now, let the dress rehearsals begin. Okay, Siri, uh, end video. Oh, no, wait, okay. Uh, sorry, I mean, uh, Siri, uh, ascend. There. Yeah. Uh, yeah, that should do it. Oh, I wonder how they find, found out about the drama department was in danger, Mr. Whiskers. Meow. Yeah, do you know? No, no, me neither. Did you know I performed in Cats once, Mr. Whiskers? Meow. I was tremendous. Meow, 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 meow. Oh, look, Mr. Whiskers, this never sent. Oh, Siri, you troublemaker. Here, if I, if I press send. So, Andrew sings to Cat. Good to know. Anyway, dress rehearsal. I was thinking, since we're at home, we're going to have to get creative. Like, we could sing some of the toothbrushing songs in an actual bathroom using an actual toothbrush and toothpaste. Check it out. This could be great for the big plaque battle at the end of the show where Clack is all like. This mouth is my lonely mouth. I don't want you around. I'm sick of dealing with your flashy, flashy sound. And then our heroes come in to save the day.
Wow, that was some great toothbrushing. Amazing d d form. Though it was kind of hard to hear the lyrics. Well, we'll work on that later. I've been working on the plaque song in the Great Gum Canyon all day. I think I found the perfect way to perform it at home. Well, I had some interruptions before, but we're all good now. This is scene three, take six. emotional center of the entire story. That heart-wrenching moment when Tommy Tooth apologizes? What? I've been practicing my expressions in the mirror all day, and I think I may have achieved an Audra McDonald level performance. I just have to capture on film, but that's easy enough. Here I go. When you look at my face, you can clearly see I need you When you look at my heart You will understand I care If you take a deep look into my eyes You'll see a soul that never lies My face, my heart, my smile, my teeth, my eyes Wow, that was, um, well... 
The singing was great, but... <laughs> the camera work was a little bit off. I have an idea, and it might make things a little bit easier. What if Tommy Tooth was played by an actual toothbrush? That way, you can see his whole body while he's singing. It's brilliant, isn't it? When you look at my face, you can clearly see I need you. Amazing, right? When you look at my heart, you will understand I care. What a performance! If you take a deep breath, my face, my heart, my smile, my teeth, my eyes. Okay. Maybe it wasn't the best idea. Hello from your lighting designer. I thought I'd demonstrate some ways you can do lighting design at home. For instance, you could turn the lights on, or you could turn them off. Blackout! If you have a dimmer, you can dim them. And... Hmm, well, what else? I guess you could have some on and some off. And you could use a lamp, too. And that's about it. Good luck, I guess. Lights up. Spotlight on me. As you all know, this next song contains the most important information in the entire musical. It's the big review, and stakes are extremely high. If the audience misses this, the entire show will fall apart. We mustn't let that happen. So we must be extremely clear, like so. As we ready for this battle, our biggest battle yet, I'm reminded of a hero who I never could forget. The one who may save a force's wind. And his name is... Lime. What's a lime? Oh, right. Okay, sorry. I got him now. Going on. He's caring, he is daring, he is everybody's friend. And his name will live forever. I'll remember to the end. I met him and I've liked him ever since. And his name... Well, I guess we'll never know his name, will we? This is your stage manager here. We are moments away from showtime now. I want everyone to stay calm, okay? We are going to be fine. Fine! I'm fine. Are you fine? No, I'm sure you are. Because calm is contagious, and I am totally calm. You're all doing great. Really? Good stuff. But I do have a few tiny little notes before we go live, okay? Okay. One. Find a quiet spot to record. Two, remember your lines, especially the important ones. Three, make sure the camera is pointed at your face when you are singing about your face. Four, don't sing with a toothbrush in your mouth. I'm begging you. Five, for goodness sake, don't buy a $40 used tissue online. It's not about the show, but just don't do it, okay? Okay, we're about to go live. Remember, this is just for family and friends, so there's no need to worry. Just have fun and... Uh-oh, how is this possible? Is this real? Oh, it's real. Oh, okay, okay, uh, uh, some news. It, it, it looks like Kristen Bell heard about our show somehow, and she tweeted out the live link to her performance. And she's hosting a virtual viewing party. And over 50,000 people have RSVP'd. But that's totally fine, right? Right. Okay, places, it's showtime. Ah! Hello to all our viewers and welcome to our virtual theater. My students tell me that this is being broadcast all over the interwebs. We thank you for joining us. As always, we remind you to unwrap your candies and turn your devices off now. Oh, 
uh, a message. Uh, my stage manager is telling me you are actually watching this on your device. So, uh, leave them on, I guess? Huh, that's neat. Uh, anywho, uh, some of you have been with us from the beginning, from our first production, In the Tights, a Shakespearean hip-hop opera. Oh, those were the days. And uh, some of you are experiencing our drama club for the very first time. We thank you for joining us. This club means so much to us, and we would hate the thought of losing it forever. And never mind all that. Anyway, without any further ado, I give you Brushes with Greatness, the Dental Hygiene Musical. <laughs> Your old floss pal. I haven't seen you since the deep cleaning of 92 when you banished halitosis. She was awful. You were legendary. That was a long time ago, Flossie. I don't clean mouths no more. I'm retired. But we've got ourselves a serious plaque situation and nobody cleans like you. Plaque's too big for me now, kid. There's no hope. I. We don't give up. We don't give in. We journey again, although we face our greatest foe, we don't give up, yes this I know, we'll tell that black and gingivitis to just stay away, with brush and floss together we can keep back the decay, so what do you say? Alright Flossy, I'm in. Hey, it's me, Plaque, and I found the perfect place to live. This mouth is amazing. Look at all the tartar and buildup in this glorious gum canyon. Shh, do you hear that? No? That's because it's the sound of perfect silence and serenity. There's no toothbrush or floss in sight, and I'm totally certain they aren't hiding anywhere nearby eavesdropping. Amazing. I like it, Q-U-I-E-T. Yes, quiet is the best for me. How I like the lovely hush. Away from a buzzing brush. Oh, fa-la-la, cha-la-la, shoobity doo ba dee dee It's shh, quiet time for me. This is the best. I'm so glad I banished Tommy Tooth, Bob Flossie, and the most terrible mouth cleaner of all. He who must not be named. I like the food quite sugary. Yes, candy fills my heart with glee. Nothing like a sweet old snack to give the boost a good old plaque. That's me. Forget to floss, I'm the boss. Thank you for setting me free. It's shh, quiet time for me. My name is Q-E, I mean U-E, I'm working on a cavity. My 
favorite word of all is neglect. I strike when you least expect. Say yay to K every day. Cavity, cavity, we it's shh. Quiet time for shh. Quiet time for shh. Quiet time for me. I cannot deny it. I love it so quiet. The silence is what I enjoy. I blame you when I was the one to blame. But now we have a serious plot problem and we need your help, partner. Please, 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 please. I'm begging you. Harold, I know you've been down this road before. And you said you'd never work with me again. Yes, I know. Stayed away for once. Tommy Tooth? Harold Rince? Bob Flossie? That dental trifecta? You betcha. And we want you out of this mouth. Forget it. This is my turf now. And I think this tooth is ready for it. No! Not the molar! Don't you? This mouth is my domain now. I don't want you around. I'm sick of dealing with your flossing, brushing sounds. Leave that tooth alone. Never! Then it's time for battle. Come on, team. No roots will die, defying cavities. Kiss plaque goodbye, defying cavities. The tooth can't be pulled out. I won't go easily. And neither will my friend, Gingivitis. Oh no, there's two of them. That's right, and we're gonna wreck this tooth. Wait, please, you have to see reason.
incredible, truly remarkable. Oh, that was the best defined cavities I've seen since I saw Adele Dazim make her off, off, off Broadway debut. Oh, thank you for tuning in. It means the world to us. And Oh, uh, uh, I, I'm, I'm, I'm terribly sorry. Uh, no, no phones on in the theater. I should go. Thank you. Thank you all. Uh, hello? Oh, hello, Principal Snellgrove. Oh, you watched. Uh, oh, they did. They do? Oh, that's wonderful news. Thank you, thank you, thank you for saving the drama club. Oh, of, of course. We'll be back next year with Greasy, the Car Mechanic musical. All right. <laughs> Thanks again. Uh, thank you. Oh, is this, is this still recording? Oh, what is up with this technology? It's almost like I left it on on purpose. Well, since I have you, students, I want to thank you so much for participating in this production. I know we couldn't be together in person, but we created our own community, and I'm so happy that the show went online. School is closed, the theater too. What are the actors supposed to do? How do we go on with the show? Thank you.